All right, so let's take a look at how PowerPoint handles animation order, specifically animation order for multiple selected objects. So we had a couple of questions, and maybe you already know this, in which case uh, it's probably nothing new, but we had a few questions around how PowerPoint really assigns each of those orders. So I think what happened, right, is so if you, just working normally, right, if you select an object and you click fade, it applies that animation. Maybe I click another one, I click fade, it applies that, click another one, fade, and so on. You can see over here that each of these, um, and of course the name of each of these objects is obviously the, the same as the, uh, the num number value. One, two, and three, if I click play, one, two, and three, it plays in sequential order. That would make sense if I wanted it to play like that. I think the questions were coming around, let me just do that. When uh, folks were selecting their graphics, shift clicking them like I am now, and selecting objects on the slide, applying a fade animation, and of course they're coming in together at this point because they're all um, on the same uh, on click event. If I right click and choose start on click, and they all get their own on click, what happened was I think because they selected them out of order, uh, they appear to be animating out of order or randomly. And that's not the case at all. PowerPoint just recognizes the order in which each of these graphics was selected and applies the animation accordingly. So what I think some folks were trying to do was come in here, move, you know, when it's totally legit, right? You can move these around any way you want, one, two, and three. You can arrange the order. Just an extra time tiger if you're doing this with a lot of animations. Your best option, just remove those, is to select the objects in the order in which you want them to appear. So one, right, two, three, now that I selected each of these in the uh, uh, sequential order and I apply a fade and maybe come over here and just do uh, start on click and now if I click play they're gonna play in order so just a real quick overview of how PowerPoint handles the uh, animation order uh, when you're working with multiple selected objects